Another blessed evening out there. Welcome to the Potter's Gate online broadcast. As you know, my name is Isaiah Phillips Akintola. I want to welcome you tonight as we continue to look into the mind of God regarding this glorious uh, season we've been ushered into. Uh, this afternoon, we had a wonderful time just allowing the Spirit of God to speak to us and to give us direction particularly as we look at fast in relating to spiritual investment. That is something that at least caught my attention. And I believe that if you are joining us and you're connecting to what we are saying, I believe that that show, you know, means something to you too. I'm going to continue on that, you know, a, a, a path. I'm going to continue to look at that thought and uh, I want to believe that once again tonight, the Lord will grant us a uh, um, greater inroad into the revelation, amen, of his heart and his mind, particularly as we deal with the issue of, you know, fast in relating to spiritual breakthrough. Of course, we have said it and we'll continue to, you know, emphasize it that we are fasting, amen, to develop ourselves. We're fasting to have if you will, spiritual breakthrough. We want to enter into the confluence of heaven's uh, uh, prophetic intentions for our life. We want to experience all of the things that the Father, amen, has ordained for us, but not just for us as individuals, but as, you know, as a family, as, as a community of the body of Christ. We want, we want to experience everything that the Lord, amen, as planned and handmarked for us for this new season. Indeed, we have been ushered into a new season, into a new day, and uh, how we understand, amen, the, 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 the reality of this new day, amen, I, I believe will be dependent on how far we proceed, amen, in, in the direction of God's heart and mind, amen, for us. So we have to do everything we can, amen, to press in, to continue to seek, to continue to, you know, uh, uh, develop uh, uh, that inquisitive spiritual uh, uh, um you know, attitude and appetite, if you will, right? The Bible says for the deep calls to the deep, amen, like the noise of many waters. I believe that the further we go in search, the further we go in quest, we read the scripture uh, this afternoon, amen, in Psalm, 80, Psalm 84, amen. The Bible says those who make their journey through the valley of Baca, amen, they make it a spring as they go on, amen, to appear before God in zion that that scripture captures you know uh, uh what we are about what we are seeking for what we are longing for amen in the place of fast we are journeying to the place called spiritual you know perfection the place called zion we want to enter we want to access and we want to annex all of the things that heaven amen has ordained for us but i'd like to take your mind back again to the concept of fast as as, as a spiritual investment i think that is something that we can look into we can you know uh, 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 commit our attention to amen because th there are there are things that i believe that we are able to do or we can do uh, uh, just by the mere fact that amen we uh, as others have you know have invested on our behalf we have you know spiritual parenting who have you know uh, invested amen on our behalf who have you know uh, uh, bought certain things have you know uh, you know a uh, uh, receive certain things amen spiritually and have kept them for us and i believe that's the same thing that we ought to do we should be doing right now particularly when we look at amen uh, a world out there that you know have no sense of you know uh the the things of god in fact everything that defines god and his intention has systematically been eroded all right, in 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 in, a, in an environment like that, we want to be able to develop, amen, uh, you know, a sense of spiritual, amen, investment. We want to be able to teach our children the way of God. We want to be able to build them, amen, in in in, in relating to God's, you know, values, standards. We want to establish them on the pathway, amen, of the kingdom. The one we want them to walk on that straight and narrow path, amen, so that their life, amen, is not cut short by the lies 
ways of the enemy. We, we want to do that. And of course, we want to do the same for the church. If, if you're a leader, amen, if you're leading people, you want to invest amen, uh, 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 spiritually into their spiritual growth. You want to be able to build them you know, into that you know, uh, 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 um, order of life amen, that, that, that manifests amen, perfection and maturity in Christ Jesus. Remember, that is the work of the fivefold ministry. The work of the fivefold ministry is to build the saints, amen, until the saints are mature enough to carry out, you know, God's intentions and plans and purposes for their life. So I, I see this concept of fast, amen, in, 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 in relating to uh, uh, investment as something very, very, uh, you know, critical for us as the body of Christ. And I pray, I hope that we will continue, amen, to look at our spiritual activity from this point so that we are not, we are not fixative on just ourselves. We are not looking at what we can get from it. Let's look beyond our Self, amen. Let's look at what the Lord, amen, is going to be doing in the life of those that He has commi committed into our hands, amen, yeah, into our family, amen, our loved ones, and of course, into the nations. We can stand in the gap on behalf of nations. We can pray for God, amen, to 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 you know to stretch His hand into the nation through our fasting, amen. Of course, we have seen that in the Scripture. A couple of people have fasted to receive, amen, direction to receive. Uh, 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 information to receive capacity to receive grace amen to, they are fasted amen to develop amen even a better understanding of you know their spiritual position and, and authority now I, i'd like us to go to uh, uh matthew chapter chapter 13 in matthew chapter 13 verse 24 matthew 13 24 the bible says jesus said the kingdom of God, well, Jesus, you know, told another parable. He said, the kingdom of heaven is like a man who sowed a, a good seed, amen, who sowed a good seed in the field. But while everyone was sleeping, amen, his enemy came and sowed weed among the wheat. And, uh, and of course, and he went away. When the, when the wheat sprouted, amen, and, and formed heads, then the weed also appeared. The owner, the, the, the owner's servant came to him and said, Sir, did you not sow good seed in this field? Where then did the wheat come from? The enemy, as the enemy did this, he replied. The servant asked, Do you want us to go and you know pull them up? No, he said. He answered, No, because while you are pulling the weed, amen, you may look not that you may, you may. You, you may, while pulling the wheel, you may root up, amen, the wheat with them. Let both grow together until the harvest. At that time, I will tell you, I will tell the harvest, uh, the harvesters, first collect the weeds and then and, and tie them in the bundle and tie them in the bundle to be bound and then gather the wheat and bring them into the, into my barnyard. Now, what I quickly want to bring out there is that all right, the kingdom of God is, is depicted, amen, as a farmer who went to what to sow a seed. And of course, that's talking about investment. The scripture, amen, uh, ex, you, you know, use the concept of farming, amen, to, 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 to define what the principles, amen, of kingdom reality in terms of sowing and investing and of course harvesting and and and, and i think this is something that amen we want to expand on amen as we look at fasting because when we fast i guess most time amen we have this fixative idea of what we are fasting for but we can begin to expand amen our spiritual horizon amen to such a level that when we talk about fast let's begin to see amen the generation let's begin to see posterity let's begin to see amen something that transcends the now let's let's see fasting amen as 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 an opportunity to develop amen spiritual you know wisdom or understanding if you will vision amen into the future and this is what i believe the lord was actually emphasizing this afternoon while we were looking at this concept and i believe that if we look at fasting as something that we are investing into that will touch that will change amen that will impact that can in fact tilt amen uh, 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 the position of power regarding the next you know uh, 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 
dimension of the life that we are coming into then i think we will do more amen to you know to really invest into it and i believe this is something god really wants us to look into and i, I believe that as we you know focus more on this aspect that we are fasting for amen something beyond ourselves amen we're fasting for a, a, a dimension of life amen that can impact amen the next generation i think we will bring more you know a sense of readiness and and determination into it i believe that one of the reasons why many people really do not engage in fasting is because they are not fully fully convinced and and aware amen of you know the benefits in terms of you know a, a, a changing transforming life society amen and of course the world amen as a whole and if we begin to look at this amen from amen, a kingdom perspective that we are actually sowing into the kingdom of god we are investing into the kingdom of god when we fast amen we are accelerating amen dimensions within our spiritual walk amen and and, and life that can increase Increase that can build that can empower amen and of course i can push further the agendas of god i believe that more people amen will fast regardless of how we think or feel amen of the immediate pain when we consider the immediate pain or or the immediate uh, 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 need challenges that we face in fast we might find it difficult to want to do that, but when we begin to think about, amen, the joy ahead, the breakthroughs that, that, that will come, because of course we know that fasting opens us up to spiritual, you know, reality, to spiritual dimension, amen. Fasting grants us, amen, capacity in the spirit, amen, to continue to advance in the light of God's will. Fasting allow us, amen, to see things the way heaven ordained them, amen. Fasting allow us to be able to engage, amen, with forces, with power, amen, beyond the, you know, uh, uh, the, the, the concepts that we have already spoken about in terms of what fasting does, amen. I believe that there is more amen to fast that we can we can we can look at and of course we can bring out that will enhance our work our life amen and of course empower us i i know that we wrote down some points amen of what we can benefit from from fasting and uh I'm just looking at, you know, uh, some of this point, but beyond this seven points that we have mentioned, and I remember also talking about, you know, we having about, you know, uh, uh, you know, is it 22, 22 or 20, you know, something points that I listed down some time ago regarding fast. But I, I want us to look at fasting beyond just, okay, something that benefits us to amen, a dimension of life that actually benefits, amen, those people, amen, that, you know, God has committed into our lives, the, you know, the, the, the people that God has, you know, brought into our space, all right, that we can actually fast to change their life, to change their perspective, to change their view, to change their concept of thinking. And I think this is something that, amen, the Lord, amen, is is, is emphasizing of course fasting will allow us to also grow in our spiritual authority all right in in, in the things of the of the of, of the spirit we need spiritual authority to be able to exercise amen uh, 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 you know our our right amen in, in 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 advancing the purposes of god excuse me So we, we, we want to believe the Lord, amen, to help us to continually look at some of this point. The kingdom of heaven is like a man who sowed his seed, amen, who sowed his seed, amen, in a field. Uh, and we, we as, as we sow this seed, of course, fasting is a seed that we, you know, we, 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 we invest into or we sow into, amen. As we do that, I believe, amen, that what we're going to be generating in terms of harvest, amen, will, will impact lives, will impact, you know, society, will impact, amen, even our sense of, you know, spiritual, you know, acceleration and, and expectation, Yes, I believe that these things, amen, can actually help us to develop more sense of spiritual awakening and 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 sense of readiness, you know, capacity, you know, grace, you know, faith, hallelujah, that that we can declare the things that heaven has ordained for us, and of course, see those things manifest, amen, in our lives and within the lives of those heaven has commit committed into our hands. And this is something that I would like us to really pray about. Lord, we we want to thank you once again tonight that as you sp you speak to us about fasting in terms of investing 
We want to believe tonight, oh God, that as we continue to wait, yes, this is our fourth day. Tomorrow will be our fifth day. We pray in the name of Jesus that you will continue to give us knowledge, wisdom, understanding, grace, capacity. Yes, Lord, to continue to, yes, wait on you, to continue to invest, to continue to sow, to continue to press in in the name of Jesus such that our life indeed becomes a manifestation of your of your glory uh, uh, that our life becomes a radiant yes expression of your intention and so I thank you once again tonight in the name of Jesus the Lord as we fast as we uh, uh, continue oh God yes we are going to be breaking a lot of people I believe they're already breaking their fast you eat something but we remind ourselves of the benefits of waiting of fasting of trusting in you we thank you lord for the benefits we thank you lord for the healing that is taking place the transformation the deliverance that is taking place in our lives in our space among those oh god that yes you have com committed into our hands we honor you tonight oh god for a change that is taking place men and women who have been transformed imparted oh god yes heal restore deliver from every shackle of bondage we honor you tonight thank you father for your will and plans and purposes that is being fulfilled tonight we honor you father for changes that is taking place in the minds of men yes lord in their heart in their soul in their spirit thank you father for new position new understanding new height in the spirit new concept oh god of thinking thank you father that yes the old man is been is been is been dealt with in the place of fast thank you lord that the new man is gaining ascendance thank you spirit of god that we are wearing yes a sense of garment that will allow us oh god yes father to draw nearer to you we praise your name tonight we thank you for the change that is taking place in our homes in our family among yes our loved ones in, in our environment oh god thank you lord that you are allowing us to have better insight better revelation better wisdom under Understanding, guiding, yes, your counsel. Fasting is opening us up to dimension in the spirit. Yes, you are giving us the keys of David. Hallelujah. Yes, you are unlocking dimensions within our inner man, oh God. We thank you. We praise your name. Thank you, Spirit of God, that our mind right now is bound to your counsel. We bind every aspect, oh God, yes, of our life to your will. We declare in Jesus' name, Lord, that we are focused, yes on eternal things, on, on spiritual things, on things that defines who we are within, yes, your kingdom. We declare that our identity is more clearer. Oh God, we thank you. We praise your name. We honor you tonight. We praise your name. We lift your name on high. Thank you, Father, for renewal. Thank you, Father, for development. Thank you, Father, for impartation. Thank you, Father, for revelation. Thank you, Father, for transformation. Thank you, Father, for reformation. Thank you, Spirit of God, that you have given to us, yes, a quick understanding. Thank you, Lord, that you have enabled us tonight in Jesus' name to once again to stand our ground and to resist every works of the enemy we praise your name lord we thank you lord that we are serious with our spirituality and you are enabling us you are granting us grace oh god yes father we thank you we praise your name lord that as we take this period serious we thank you for changes that are occurring i thank you for changes that are taking place within my own life oh god thank you lord that you have removed weights yes sin weights you are removing there in the life of my friends and loved ones in the life of the body of christ you are removing every weight and sin that can easily beset us as we buffet our flesh as we wait on you thank you father god for change that is taking place in our life thank you lord that we are able to travel light thank you spirit of god that indeed our life is at that point where indeed we are accelerating we are going further we are pressing further we are receiving we are proclaiming we are collecting that which you have given to us we bless your holy name we honor you we praise you we we glorify your name thank you lord that our body right now yes our body system respond in the name of jesus yes lord we are being detox oh god from everything that is contrary to your will we are binding our ourselves to you and we are casting down imagination 
and every high thing that exalt themselves above your will in our life. Thank you, Lord, that you give us rest. You give us peace. You give us, yes, joy. Thank you, Lord, that you put our mind to rest. Anxiety has no place in our life. Lord, we honor your name for all of the things that you are doing right now. We thank you. We, 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 we praise your name. We exalt you. Have your way. Take your place. Be glorified. Be magnified in our life. Thank you, Spirit of God, for newness, new beginning. Thank you, Father, for refreshing, refreshing. We are being refreshed tonight in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, that we are being refreshed. Weight and sin are gone in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, that the barriers and the bondages, yes, that the enemy has placed upon us right now are removed. Thank you, Lord, that the chains of the enemy is broken and shattered. We are free and liberated in Jesus' name. Thank you once again. We receive keys of the kingdom to access realms and reality within your heart, O oh God. Thank you that the revelation of Christ is becoming even more pronounced in our life. Lord, we thank you that we are able to ascend higher. Yes, on that dimension of heal that you have called us to, to operate from. Thank you, Lord, that the mountain of your house is establishing us. Thank you, Lord, that you have built your intentions in us. Thank you, Lord, for newness. Thank you, Father, for revelation. Thank you, Father, for illumination. Thank you, Father, for translation in the name of Jesus. We are being translated to the place, oh God, of your glory and power. Thank you, Spirit of God. We bless your holy name. Thank you for reformation. Thank you, Lord, that we are not conformed to this world, but rather we are transformed by the renewing of our mind. Our mind is renewed. Thank you for changes. Thank you, Father, for breakthrough. Thank you for favor. Thank you, Lord, that you are sending, yes, Lord, favor across our path in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We praise your name, Lord, for ministry that is taking place right now. New ministry, new relationship. Thank you, Spirit of the Lord. New ministry, new relationship. Thank you for new open doors. Hallelujah. We praise you. We glorify your holy name. We bless your holy name. We call for the things that be not as though they were. We praise your holy name for changes now that is taking place in our life. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you for the things that you're doing right now. Thank you for the things that you're bringing across our way. Thank you, Lord, for openings of doors. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father, for new relationship, new friendship new relationship thank you spirit of god thank you father for financial breakthrough thank you lord for healing deliverance financial breakthrough healing deliverance financial breakthrough in jesus name openings of doors we praise your name right now thank you father for the keys of david thank you father i bless your holy name oh hallelujah glory glory to your name thank you once again tonight we break barriers we break limitation thank you lord that we break the rubicon we advance we procure in jesus name your favor and goodness mercy and love oh god we receive in jesus name thank you spirit of god for your healing power thank you for your word yes once again that becomes light to us thank you for the richness of your word thank you for the treasures of your kingdom hallelujah we thank you we bless your name. I, I thank you, Lord, for new chapter, Lord, for this ministry. New chapter for Potter's Gate. New opening, new beginning. Thank you, Father, for sending help, oh God. Yes, for vain is the help of man. Thank you, Lord, for addition, addition, addition. Thank you for breakthrough, deliverance, healing, financial breakthrough in our lives, in our ministry. I thank you, Almighty oh, God. I thank you for what you're doing in our family. Thank you, Spirit of God, that no evil shall be for us. No plague will come near our dwelling. I bless your holy name lord thank you spirit of god Th thank you lord that we are able to tap into the spirit we're able to understand things uh, we're able to hear we're able to receive clarity direction thank you lord that wisdom is building this house knowledge yes guides us thank you for the fear of god your knowledge your fear in our life thank you for the spirit of counsel thank you lord that we are established tonight to the glory of your holy name oh hallelujah we are established we are established i, I bless your name lord for every man every woman out there that will be listening that will be watching that will be yes part, part participating in this in this prayer time lord i thank you lord that as they listen oh god as they join oh god that, that, that their life right now is receiving a turnaround in the name of jesus thank you father god for opening doors for us thank you lord for breakthroughs thank you spirit of god that we are not tired yes lord we are strong in you we are strong in you we are strong in you your word declared that yes let the weak say i am strong we are strong in you we are strong in your word we are strong in the things that you have proclaimed and declare thank you for your promises that are yea and amen thank you lord that your word will not return empty or void your word will accomplish the things uh, that you have ordained and desired i thank
thank you spirit of god yes tonight for changes 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 in our lives changes in our psyche changes in our thought pattern changes in the way we think changes in our philosophy thank you father for a new pattern of lifestyle thank you lord for a new pattern of thinking thank you lord that you have giving us victory over every lie of the enemy over every attack of the enemy thank you spirit of god for victory we honor you we praise your name lord we thank you for knowledge the knowledge that comes from your word thank you father for the knowledge of truth thank you father for grace thank you father for the realities of your kingdom that becomes plain to us thank you lord that we do no longer see things in parable we no longer hear in parable you speak to us with plainness thank you spirit of god that the things that have been hidden for us we receive in jesus us near thank you for grace for nobility to understand hallelujah we praise your name we honor you tonight thank you lord for minds that are free deliver thank you father for healing that is taking place right now thank you for anxiety that is gone in jesus name oppression depression is gone sickness sickness disease infirmity gone poverty you have no place in our life in the name of jesus lord i thank you for the things that you're doing thank you father for the ability to comprehend thank you father for the ability to understand stand. Thank you, Father, for the ability, yes, to accurately interpret the times and the seasons. We bless your name. We honor you. We glorify your name. Thank you for the things that you have done. Thank you, Lord, for supernatural visitation. Thank you, Father, for the power of dreams and vision. Glory to Jesus. Thank you for the spirit of illumination. Thank you, Father, for, yes, right now, the seed that we are sowing, we are reaping in Jesus' name. Godly seed, righteous seed, to the glory of your holy name. We praise your name. We thank you, Father. We honor you. We praise your name we glorify your name thank you father for newness 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 thank you father for newness newness new life uh, new beginning we bless your name lord uh, for breakthrough thank you spirit of the lord hallelujah yes lord we thank you we honor you we glorify your name for spiritual deliverance uh, hallelujah 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 glory glory praise honor power majesty be ascribed unto you thank you lord that we are able to accomplish and fulfill all that you have commissioned commissioned into our hands as ministry i thank you spirit of the lord hallelujah i give you glory tonight i give you praise oh god i give you praise oh god i give you glory i give you praise oh god for breakthrough major breakthrough in our life major breakthrough physical materially financially emotionally psychologically thank you for openings of doors thank you father for divine connection hallelujah divine connection divine connection divine acceleration divine breakthrough hallelujah praise you jesus thank you father thank you father for capacity capacity to to understand to see things oh god the way you ordain them lord i thank you thank you lord for every weight and sin tonight uh, is gone thank you lord that we travel lighter thank you lord Hall hallelujah we praise your name lord uh, for newness 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 your kingdom come lord uh, thank you father that we're able to birth things uh, in accordance to your intention thank you for your prophetic mandate oh god that is being fulfilled in our lives thank you lord for capacity for revelation 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 thank you for the spirit of revelation thank you lord for the spirit of wisdom thank you lord for the spirit oh god yes of grace thank you for favor 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 openings of doors thank you spirit of god that we advance there's no limit in our life thank you father for favor 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 there is no limit in our life thank you lord that we break forth uh, into 2022 we go forth in jesus name thank you spirit of god for newness thank you father for spiritual deliverance thank you father for mental deliverance thank you father for financial breakthrough thank you father for the keys of david openings of doors i, I thank you father for yes beautiful ashes i thank you lord for our children lives thank you lord jesus uh, for glorious things that you're doing right now thank you father for sowing seed oh god or fast into yes lord uh, into the lives of our children our loved ones oh god our family we thank you lord for restoration thank you father for reconciliation in this time of fasting yes sir. Thank, thank you father for reconciliation thank you father for reconciliation thank you father for alignment oh god thank you father for alignment thank you father for the spirit of divine alignment thank you father for divine connection thank you father for divine connection
connection. Connect us, oh God, with people that matters. Thank you, Father, for connecting us, oh God, yes, to the right people, to the right places, oh God. Thank you, Father, for openings of doors. Uh. Thank you, Lord, for openings of doors. Uh. Thank you, Lord, for openings of doors. Uh. Doors spiritually, I command it to be open. Yes, physically, I declare be open. Uh. Doors, yes, doors of favor, doors of breakthrough in the name of Jesus, doors of healing, doors of deliverance. Uh. Be open in the name of Jesus. Uh. In the name of Jesus, doors of divine protection in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Spirit of the Lord. We honor you tonight uh, for the things that you're doing. No weapon from the fashion against us uh, will prosper. Thank you, Lord, that your church is matching up. The gates of hell shall not prevail. The gates of hell will not prevail. Thank you, Lord, for spiritual breakthrough. Thank you, Lord, for mental breakthrough. Thank you for soundness of mind. Uh, soundness of mind. Depression, you are gone. Uh, in the name of Jesus, oppression, you are gone. Uh, anxiety, you are gone. Fear, you are gone. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, I thank you right now for boldness. Uh, boldness. Boldness to speak. Uh, boldness to declare your counsel. Thank you, Lord, that we will not be afraid. Uh, thank you, Lord, that we will speak your counsel. Thank you, Lord, that we will not be men pleaser, but we will please you. We will honor you. We will glorify you. Christ, you'll be formed in us. Uh, you will grow in us. You will develop in us. Uh, you will mature in us. Your will will prosper in our hands through our lives. Uh, your purposes will prosper in our hands. I uh, thank you tonight. In the name of Jesus, advancement, uh, breakthrough, breakthrough. Lift up your hands, oh, ye gates. Uh, Hashem does be lifted up. Uh, let the King of Glory come in. In the name of Jesus, let there be a divine access uh, of the things of the Spirit. Uh, Lord, I thank you that uh, the scales are falling of our eyes. Uh, we can see, we can hear in the name of Jesus. Uh, hallelujah. That we would, yes, indeed, partake of the things uh, that you have ordained for us. Uh, thank you, Lord, that we receive uh, our spiritual inheritance uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I thank you right now. Thank you right now that sin have no power over us. Uh, sin has no power over us. Uh, sickness, disease uh, have no place in our life. Uh, thank you, Lord, that you have destroyed every hold of sickness, disease, infirmity, the powers of virus uh, and nullify in the name of Jesus. Uh, thank you, Lord, that we rise up uh, as a victorious church. Uh, we rise up, Lord, as a victorious church. Uh, you who have begun a good work uh, in us, oh God, we rise up, Lord. Uh, we thank you, Lord, that you're able to perfect it uh, to the glory of your name. Uh, we thank you, Lord, uh, as we continue to wait upon you. Lord, we receive uh, a renewer, a renewer, a renewer of our strength. Uh, oh God, we receive a renewer of our strength. Uh, whatever strength, oh God, uh, is or means to us, uh, we receive, oh God, strength physically, strength emotionally, strength psychologically in the name of Jesus. Uh, uh, yes, Lord, strength of, 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 of our mindset, uh, strength in Jesus' name, of our IQ, in the name of Jesus, financial strength, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, in the name of Jesus, strength, uh, in the area of knowledge and wisdom, uh, in the name of Jesus, we receive strength, uh, the strength, yes, uh, of divine favor, we receive in Jesus' name. Uh, Lord, I thank you tonight uh, that we are advancing, we are lifted uh, in Jesus' name. We are being transformed. We are of the order of the second man in the name of Jesus. Uh, we, are the, we are of the order of the second man, the new man in Christ Jesus. Uh, we rise. Uh, thank you, Lord, that we have been free from every shackle. Thank you, Spirit of God, that we have been delivered from the nature of the first man in the name of Jesus. Uh, we are of the order of the second man. Yes, the, the new man in Christ Jesus. Uh, I thank you, Father, for, a, for the glorious reality of your power and presence uh, in our life. Thank you, Lord, that uh, change uh, is occurring in our lives, uh, in our minds, in our soul, in our family, in our, in our ministry, in our career, in our workplace. Uh, openings of doors, uh, doors be open uh, in the name of Jesus. Advancement uh, is taking place right now. Breakthrough in the name of Jesus. Uh, deliverance uh, in Jesus' name. All things are working together for our good uh, because we love the Lord uh, and we are called after his purpose. Uh, I thank you right now. I thank you right now for mighty breakthrough. Mighty breakthrough. Thank you, Lord. You are the breaker. Thank you, Spirit of the Lord. You are the Spirit of the breaker. Thank you, Lord, that you break barriers. You break limitation. Thank you, Spirit of God, for visions and revelation. Thank you for dimension in the Spirit right now. Thank you for acceleration. Thank you, Father, for new heights in the Spirit. Thank you, Lord, that we are climbing the ladder of Jacob. We are ascending. Hallelujah. We are in the position called the mountain of the Lord. From here, we can govern. He said, on that day, men shall say, let us go up to the mountain of the Lord's house. Thank you, Lord, for great great things that you're doing. Thank you for harvest. Harvest that is taking place in our lives. In our lives, in our homes, in our ministry. Grace. Great things. Great things. In the name of Jesus, breakthrough. 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 In the name of Jesus, deliverance. In the name of Jesus, healing, restoration, deliverance. Thank you, Spirit of God, for, for you are doing a new thing. 
you are restoring the things that the enemy have stolen in the past two in the past two two years the enemy have stolen a lot of things from us yes the enemy have stolen a lot of things from us but we declare in the name of jesus this is a day of restoration you say when the enemy is caught he will be made to pay back sevenfold father we begin to declare we begin to make demand of everything the enemy have stolen from us our joy our peace in the name of jesus yes in the name of jesus the things he spoke stolen from our homes from our, our family our ministry we begin to reclaim them back in sevenfold in the name of jesus father thank you right now for the restoration of the things that the enemy have stolen from our life in the name of Jesus, jobs that have been lost, family that have been shattered, broken. Father, we declare restoration in the name of Jesus. In this day, Father, we proclaim that we receive restoration to the glory of your holy name. We refuse to take no for an answer. We break barrier. We break limitation. We procure that which the Father has ordained for us. We come into our inheritance and we declare right now victory in Jesus' name. Victory is our portion. Victory is our portion. Oh, hallelujah. Victory is our portion. Lord, we honor your holy name. Lord, we honor your holy name tonight. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit of God. We are strong. We are strong in you. You said, let the weak say, I am strong. We proclaim strength. We proclaim strength. We proclaim healing. We proclaim deliverance. We proclaim transformation, reformation. The Bible says God create all things by the word of his power. Right now we release the word of God. Yes, to begin to create, to begin to transform, to begin to renew, to begin to rebuild. Yes, in the beginning he said let there be light everywhere in your life, in your home, in your family, in your career, in your ministry that the enemy has proclaimed darkness. I begin to declare light in those in those dimensions, in those areas. I declare light into your home, into your space. I turn on the light right now upon every darkness. I declare in the name of Jesus. Let the light of God right now begin to penetrate into your home, into your household uh, in the name of Jesus, into your ministry, into your career, in the name of Jesus, into your person. I declare light into your mind. Uh, wherever there is darkness uh, in your mind I speak light right now in Jesus name. Uh, wherever there is darkness uh, in the life of your children I speak light there right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, wherever there is darkness uh, in your business I speak light there right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, wherever there is darkness in your ministry I speak light in the name of Jesus I speak the light of God the transcendent light of God the illuminating light of God Jesus said I am the light of the world he who walks with me will not walk in darkness he who follows me will not walk in darkness let the light of God right now begin to penetrate yes the transcendent light the light that man cannot see yeah, with their natural eyes the light that will cause man that will sham, the rich the powerful to fall from their heart uh, the Bible says, and a great light shone from heaven, and, and Saul fell from his from his house. Uh, Father, we declare, let your light begin to shine. Let every 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 loftiness uh, begin to collapse, begin to fall. Uh, in the name of Jesus, let the light that leads us, the, let the light that guides us begin to ch begin to change us, begin to transform us, begin to guide us. Uh, light in Jesus' name into your business. Come out, receive light uh, into your home, into your family. Receive light uh, into the life of your daughter. Receive Receive light uh, into the life of your son. Uh, receive light uh, into the life of your husband. In the name of Jesus, uh, darkness is evil. I declare, let every darkness right now begin to disappear, begin to dissipate, uh, begin to move. In Jesus' name, uh, I turn on light uh, over the life of your son, your daughter. In the name of Jesus, your children, I begin, I proclaim, I declare light in Jesus' name over your community, light over your city, light over your nation, light over your body, light over every aspect of your being right now light in the beginning the bible says darkness was upon the face of the deep and god said let there be light he didn't proclaim any other thing he said let there be light light is solution light is deliverance uh, light is restoration light is healing uh, light is transform trans transformation uh, light is transformation uh, light is reformation light come on is restoration light is redemption i speak lighter into your body i speak lighter into your home i speak light 
light uh, into your space. Uh, I speak light uh, into your career. I speak light uh, into that teenage life. I speak light uh, into that adult. Uh, I speak light uh, into that marriage. Uh, I speak light uh, into that business, into that career, into your education. I speak the light of God. Let there be light uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I turn on the light of God upon your space, uh, upon your realm. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, I declare light uh, in Jesus' name. Darkness is evil. Darkness is destruction. Darkness is chaos. In the name of Jesus, we are of the ministry of light. And we begin to walk in the power of light. Jesus said, I am the light of the world. There is no other light except Christ. He is the light of the world. The darkness the world is faced today, come on, can be resolved when we turn to light. When we turn to the light, in him was life. And the life became the light of man. And the light shines in darkness. No matter how complicated, no matter how complex your darkness is. I tell you, there are some darkness that are so complicated. There are some darkness that are so complex. Uh, that you don't even know where to start from uh, but I declare in the name of Jesus have uh, the authority of, of God's light uh, let the darkness have you ever seen darkness fight light have you ever seen when light when light turns up uh, darkness fights back uh, darkness cannot stand uh, when light hallelujah is in operation I declare the ministry of light uh, into your space uh, let light you that you're watching me right now I declare light into your home uh, light into your household uh, light into into your marriage, into your business, uh, light into your career. Come on, I don't care what uh, the operation of darkness means. Uh, I do not care what that darkness represents, but let the light of God begin to shine uh, upon your home, upon your life, upon your ministry, upon your business, upon your career, in the name of Jesus, upon your city, upon your community. Whatever is darkness, uh, they must bow, they must go, in the name of Jesus. Light into this ministry, light into my home, into my family, into my calling, light into my mind, into my spirit, into my soul, in the name of Jesus. Right now we declare the light of God, the ministry of God's light as we wait upon the Lord. We declare right now, let the light of God begin to create. Let the light of God begin to recreate. Let the light of God begin to transform. Let the light of God begin to heal you. Let the light of God begin to transform you. Let the light of God begin to redeem you from every shackle. In the name of Jesus, light will break the bondage of hell. Light will break every chain. Uh, let light will light will open the door. Light in the name of Jesus. Uh, receive into your home. Uh, receive light into your space right now. Be healing your body because of the light of God. D Jesus said, "I am the light." Uh, receive the ministry of divine light. Receive light. Refuse darkness. Drugs is darkness. Alcohol that brings people to a position of perplexity, of stupor is destruction whatever it is that is darkness that disgraces you darkness will disgrace you darkness will nullify yes your position darkness will make a man look like nothing darkness will turn a woman to look like nothing darkness will corrupt the mind come on of a of a, of a child darkness in the name of jesus we address you in jesus name every demonic system of darkness it's time for you to go it's time for you to leave. It's time for you to disappear. In the name of Jesus, darkness is confusion. When you see people that are confused, don't know what to do. They run from pillar to post. Jump from one thing to another. Confused, don't know how to make decision. It's darkness. When darkness captures your mind, you don't know what to do. You are bound, you are captured by anxiety. You are captured by the spirit of fear. Yes, uncertainty. Yes, depression. People cannot be happy because darkness has, has captured their mind. In the name of Jesus, let the chain of darkness right now be shattered over your life. In the name of Jesus, if you're watching me right now, raise your hand and proclaim and declare, I receive light into my soul. I receive light into my space. I receive light into my spirit. I receive life into my room. I receive the light of God. The moment you begin to declare this word, darkness will begin to flee. Because you're saying those words by faith and by trust in God's word. In the name of Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, Father, we thank you for knowledge. 
Light is knowledge. The knowledge that comes from you. Illumination. Illumination. Be, be illuminated. <clears throat> be illuminated. When you hear of the Illuminatis, that is fake light. That is fake knowledge. There is a true light that comes from Christ. Uh, he is the light of the world. He is the author of light. He is the author of life and he is the author of light. Come on. Seek him, Bragazutayanda. In the name of Jesus, everyone under the sound of my voice, I proclaim light into your home. I proclaim light into your household. I proclaim light into this community. I proclaim light into this place. I declare light in Jesus' name. Everything that represents darkness, be gone in Jesus' name. I cast you out. I cast you away. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you have no place to stay. You have no place to hide. Christ has come. His light has come. When Jesus was born, the whole world was lit, lit up. The heavens were rejoicing. The stars were dancing. Yes, because the, great, the greatest star has been born. He is the light of the world. In him there is no darkness. The Bible says, yes, the shepherds were, were dancing, were rejoicing. It says, good will to men. That's what light is. Goodwill to men. Oh, hallelujah. Praise you, Jesus, tonight. Let your word reign in our lives. Let your word reign in our homes. Let your word reign in our spirit. We proclaim light. We receive light. We walk in light in the name of Jesus. There is no darkness in our way. There is no darkness in our house. There is no darkness in our space. Thank you, Spirit of God, that everything that represents darkness mentally, people that are mentally you know, uh, 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 attacked, whatever, whatever form of attack that you're going through right now, I declare light comes into your space right now. Light comes into your room right now. Light comes into your house right now. In the name of Jesus, you that you are emotionally drained, receive strength, receive awakening, receive renewal because of the light of God. In the name of Jesus, whatever form of darkness you are battling with, oh, it's over. Light has come. In the name of Jesus, Lord, I thank you. Lord, I bless your name for newness, new beginning. Thank you, Father, for transformation. Thank you, Father, for reformation. Thank you, Father, for healing, deliverance. Thank you for the things, oh God, that your spirit, yes, is doing right now. We honor you. We glorify your holy name. Oh, hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you that light is beaming out of your people. Light, light is beaming out. Darkness is fleeing. Darkness, yes, is fleeing. Darkness is disappearing. Darkness is dissipating. Oh, hallelujah. We give you glory for a new for a new for a newness oh god thank you father for a new day thank you father for the ministry of light thank you father for the ministry of light that comes via your life in christ we have life in christ we have light in christ we have direction in christ we have solution in christ we break through in christ we are free in christ we are healed in christ we are delivered in christ we are restored in christ we are renewed in christ we are reformed in christ we prosper in the name of jesus Oh, hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Glory to Jesus. Not by might, not by the power of men, but by my spirit, say the Lord. Lord, I thank you for your spirit tonight. Thank you, Father, for what your spirit is doing. Thank you, Father, for what your spirit, yes, right now is doing. Thank you, Lord. If you cannot do it, no man can do it. If you will not do it, no one can do it. So we thank you. Our eyes are on you. My eyes are on you, Lord. My hope is in you. My hope comes from you. My trust is in you, Lord. I thank you, God. Let every man be a liar, but God be true. Let every man be a liar, but God be true. You are the one that opens the door that no one can open. And when you shut the door, no man, no system, no power, no government, 
tears open it. Thank you, Spirit of God, for the things that you are doing tonight, Lord, that we'll be able to testify of what you have done to the glory of your holy name. I give you glory. I give you glory. I thank you for supernatural things. I thank you, Father, for miraculous things uh, that you're doing. Thank you, Father, for divine intervention. Thank you, Father, for openings of doors. Uh, thank you, Father, for healing. Thank you, Father, for restoration. Thank you, Father, for miracles. Uh, yes, you said miracles are the children's bread. Tonight, I thank you for miracle upon miracle. Thank you, Father, for openings of doors. Uh, thank you, Father, for supernatural visitation. Thank you, Father, for supernatural visitation. Thank you, Father, for soundness of mind. Thank you, Father, for soundness of mind, dreams and vision. Thank you for divine direction. Thank you, Father, for multiplication. Thank you, Father, for addition. Thank you, Father, for a net-breaking miracle. Thank you, Father, for openings of doors. Uh, thank you, Spirit of God, that we will be able to testify, yes, of the goodness of God in the land of the living. Thank you, Lord, that I, as I, Philip's Akitala, will testify of the things that you have done. Thank you, Father, for supernatural, supernatural visitation. Thank you, Father, for miracles, uh, miracles, miracles, uh, miracles, miracles upon miracles. Uh, thank you, Father, for gl glorious days ahead of your people. We bless your name. Uh, we honor you. We give you glory. We give you praise, oh God. Thank you, Lord. Once again, the powers of the enemy has fell. The kingdom of darkness has been defeated. The enemy, once again, has fell. He has been in the dust. Uh, thank you, Spirit of God, for supernatural openings of doors. Thank you, Lord, uh, for miracles that uh, deliverance signs and wonder thank you father for your mighty mover thank you father for your mighty mover upon this land upon this nation upon this continent thank you father for breakthrough thank you for transformation thank you lord that you remove kings and you set yes lord new leaders oh god in the position men after your heart oh god hallelujah glory 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 victory we give a shout of victory thank you mighty god for the things that you have done no power no weapon no spirit, uh, no system can stop uh, the things that you have done. Uh, we bless your holy name tonight. Uh, thank you, Lord, uh, for the, the, the things that we witnessed yesterday, the lies of the enemy, the attack of the enemy. We have seen him defeated. Uh, we have victory uh, to the glory of your name. Hallelujah. That we are going forth conquering uh, because indeed you have conquered. Uh, we are victorious. Uh, thank you, Father, for the spirit of a champion. Uh, thank you, Father, for miracles. Uh, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Uh, hallelujah. For a knocking on our door for supernatural visitation hallelujah glory 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 hallelujah glory glory the days of miracles are here the days of signs and wonders are here the days of miracles are here your kingdom come uh, your will is done on earth uh, as it is established in heaven thank you father for supernatural openings of doors uh, keys of David uh, hallelujah thank you father for gro glorious things uh, marvelous things that you have done hallelujah Oh, hallelujah. Oh, glory to Jesus. Glory to Jesus. Glory to my King. Glory to my Lord. I praise your name. I worship you, Lamb of God. Wonderful. Mighty God. Counselor. Everlasting Father. You deserve all the praise. Once again, we want to thank everyone that has joined tonight in this prayer. If you've joined me, I want to give praise and, and, and thanks to God for your life. I declare in the name of Jesus, testimony, testimony, testimony upon testimony in the name of Jesus. Miracle upon miracle, deliverance upon deliverance, healing upon healing. Amen. Into your life, into your space, wherever you are, wherever you're going to be listening or watching this uh, a broadcast from, I declare in Jesus name as 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 you as this word hit your eardrum amen you will be touched you will be amen imparted the, the glory of god hallelujah will rest upon you the hand of god will be mighty upon you you will be transformed heal restore renew reform in jesus name in the name of jesus it is your day it's your time amen god is doing gr glorious thing hallelujah i thank god amen for your life in jesus name i thank god for your life in the name of jesus miracles father thank you I praise your name. Thank you, Father, for the things that you have done in my own life. I receive strength tonight. I receive strength. I receive, oh God, yes, renewal. I receive refresh, refreshing. I am refreshing Jesus' name. 
Thank you, Lord, that I'm renewed. Thank you, Lord, that you empower me. You endow me. Thank you, Spirit of God, for the things that you have done in my life. I bless your holy name. I give you glory. Lord, that I will grow from grace to grace. I thank you, Spirit of God, that you renew me. I thank you, Lord, as I've poured into your people. Lord, I thank you, Lord, that you will release your angels, Lord, to minister to me in Jesus' name, Lord. That I will I will finish, I will accomplish the things that you have committed into my hands, O oh God, for my generation, for my time, O oh God, for the church, for the body of Christ, for this city, for this nation, O oh God, in the name of Jesus, O oh God, for my family. I thank you, Lord, that I will continue to advance to much further in Jesus' name name not looking not, not looking back but proceeding further to the glory of your holy name i thank you lord i thank you lord for opening doors for me so that i can finish i can accomplish your mandate for my life thank you for joy unspeakable full of glory i receive oh god i am ministered to Thank you, Lord, that you will send help, oh God. You send help to me. You send help to this work. You send help in the name of Jesus. Thank you for help, Lord, from the north to the south, from the east to the west, in the name of Jesus. I bless your holy name. Thank you, Lord, for men and women who can see, yes, what I am doing and say, we want to be a blessing. We want to be part of this work. We want to sow into your life, into your ministry, into your calling. Lord, I receive to the glory of your holy name. I thank you, Lord, that my help comes from you not from any man, not from any institution, not from any sister, not from any group. My eyes are on you. You are my help. You are my hope, oh God. You are my expectation. Thank you tonight, oh God. Thank you that when one door is shut, you open yes, others. Uh, I thank you, Spirit of God. As you shut doors, you open doors. Uh, thank you, Spirit of God. Thank you, Spirit of God. You are the one who shut the door and you are the one that opened it. And therefore, oh God, all the honor and praises go to you. Uh, thank you, Spirit of God. I am not indebted to any man but unto you oh god i give all glory i give all praise i give all worship lord uh, my eyes have always been on you my hope has always come from you my strength has always been in you my faith has always been you and so once again tonight i thank you for men and women that you're going to be raising across the continent oh god to hear this voice to hear this voice oh god this uncorrupt voice oh god and say we will be a blessing to this work i thank you i bless your name i receive oh god i I thank you. I thank you. You will bring men that will perfect, oh God, those imperfections. You will bring men that will perfect, oh God, those imperfections in my life. You will bring men and women who will complete, uh, who will complete this assignment, who will carry this work, oh God. The errands and the all. Thank you, Spirit of God. I praise your name that this ministry, the Potter's Gate, uh, yes, and everything Potter's Gate represents, oh God, will continue to advance, oh God. Yes, pattern for living, you will continue to advance. Wisdom speaker will continue to advance in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. I thank you, oh God. Yes, you, this work will continue to advance. Agai's coalition, you will continue to advance. Agai's nexus, you will continue to advance uh, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. For Zadok, uh, your prophetic school will continue to advance uh, in the name of Jesus. I bless your holy name uh, for victory, breakthrough in the name of Jesus for this ministry. This ministry will become an household name to transform, to change, to build, to impact, to, to restore, to heal, to teach lives, individuals, the body of Christ, and even nation. We will continue to disciple nations. I thank you, Father. I give you all the glory. I give you all the praises. Hallelujah. My hope is in you. My eyes are on you tonight. Hallelujah. My eyes are on you. My expectation comes from you. I bless your holy name. Yes. This is a one man ministry. Yes, Lord. I thank you. The voice of one. I'm the voice of one crying in the wilderness. Prepare the way of the Lord. Make straight his path. The voice of one crying in the wilderness. Prepare the way of the Lord. Make straight his path. Prepare the way of the Lord. Isaiah Phillips Akintala. Prepare the way of the Lord. Make straight his path within the hearts of men, within community, within cities, within nations, on social platform. Prepare the way of the Lord. Make straight, make straight the path of the Lord without compromise, uh, without turning back. Uh, in the name of Jesus, my eyes are on you. My hope comes from you. My resource is you. You are my hope. You are my strength. Uh, you are my vision. Uh, I thank you, 
Lord tonight uh, that once again this vision I, I lay it down on the altar I lay this mandate on the altar I cast it down on the altar Lord let your fire fall upon it uh, consume everything that is not of you consume it oh God once again purify this work that it may stand uh, in the name of Jesus uh, this is a work that is no respecter of man in the name of Jesus uh, this is a prophetic voice uh, this is a prophetic voice to the nation thank you spirit of God we will build and we will tear down everything Lord that you have not called for in the name of Jesus uh, he said this ministry is for the rising and the falling of men in Israel thank you spirit of God that this work will continue to advance uh, this prophetic harbor uh, this Zion's ministry this Zion's gate ministry in the name of Jesus uh, this Zadok ministry will continue to pro proceed uh, to the glory of God until we all appear before you in Zion oh hallelujah Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. There is no retreat and there is no surrendering. There is no retreat and there is no surrendering. Forward ever. Backwards never. Forward ever. Backwards never. In the name of Jesus, go forth Potter's Gate. Go forth Conquer. Go forth Build. Go forth and, and Establish. This is the ministry of Ezra. This is the ministry of Nehemiah. This is the ministry of David. This is the ministry of Esther. This is the ministry of Ruth. This is the ministry of Abigail. This is the ministry of Deborah. In the name of Jesus. This is the ministry of Moses. This is the ministry of David. This is the ministry of Daniel. This is the ministry of Joshua. This is the ministry of Gideon. This is the ministry of, 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 of Timothy. This is the ministry, yes, of Paul, of Titus. This is the ministry in the name of Jesus where the counsel of God is established. This is the ministry of the ascended revelation of Christ. No power, no spirit, no system, no entity can stop or hinder what the Lord has begun to do in this ministry. Lord, I thank you. Lord, I honor your name. I rededicate this work unto you. Every book, every message, every material that you have invested in me, for your people, for your church, for the saints, for the body of Christ, for nations, they shall come out. And everyone that is out, Lord, let people begin to hear about this work. Let them hear about the Potter's Gate website. Let them hear about the Potter's Gate, yes, broadcasting ministry. Let them hear. Let them begin to come. Let them know that they can have truth undiluted. They can hear the word of God unbroken. Father, I thank you. I honor your holy name for change in this ministry. To the glory of your holy name. Yes, Lord. Thank you once again for the things that you have done. Oh, hallelujah. Praise your name, Lamb of God. Praise your name, Lamb of God. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Zambra gavazain da lalabush kayanda. In that day, I will open the door and I will do great and mighty things that will cause men to come and see the wonders of your hand. And they will see, they will come from the north, the south, and the east, and the west. And they will partake of the food. They will partake of the meal of this house. They will eat of it and they will be nourished and they will be refreshed. Ah, my zeal will accomplish this. My, my will and counsel will bring this to pass. Ah, the labors of your hands shall not be in vain. But I will cause men to be steered to hear and to see. And they will drink of this wine. This wine that will intoxicate them. Yes, into the place of newness. And see, yes, the, the things that eyes that eyes have not seen. They will hear the things that ears, yes, have not, have not heard. And they will understand because indeed I will give of them of quick understanding. Hallelujah. Glory. Glory. Thank you, my Father. Hallelujah. Yes, the journey continues. The journey continues. The battle continues. And the victory is sure. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Amen. 
and amen. Well, I want to once again give all the glory and praise and adoration to my father, to my king, the one who never fails, who has never disappointed. Yes, he will never disappoint you. Neither will he disappoint me. Thank you so very much. My dear sister Kumi, so thank you for joining tonight. And every other person out there who have joined, connected with us, I want to congratulate you for the things that the Lord, amen, has done in your life and in my life and in this ministry. May God's kingdom continue to advance. May his will continue to, amen, move from dimension of glory to glory. May the Lord, amen, continue to, amen, empower us. May he continue to flourish us, amen, with his goodness. Morning, afternoon, night, amen. As you go to bed, may you dream the dreams of God. May God plunge you into dimensions of visions and revelation. May his will continue to accelerate and prosper in your life. May no, may no power, no power, no system, amen, be able to stop you. They will gang up but they will scatter because the Lord is your shield. Because the Lord, amen, watches over you. He has sent his angels to watch over you. God bless you. Thank you so very much, everyone. I'll see you again, hopefully by God's grace tomorrow. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Have a wonderful time, amen, just seeking the Lord for the God bless you. Appreciate you. God bless you. Bye-bye.